under siege from mountain lions. Check them out, prowling right outside his window. Did you guys find a cat up there in the tree? A gated community in Colorado was shaken up last week after a mountain lion snatched up a pet dog and ate it. You need to run. Okay, I will be running up the hill, you guys on the cat then. Mountain lions, their historical range covered all of the U.S., a lot of Canada, all the way through Mexico into South America. So probably, other than humans, the widest ranging mammal in North America. Over the last two to three decades, you know, the number of reports we get from the public that there's a lion in the area has definitely been increasing. Why that is is probably related to the number of people moving into lion habitat. Some of the theories people have had about uh, mountain lions and how they use these urban areas is that they've become habituated to people and they're no longer afraid of people and that's going to increase the probability that a lion is going to attack a human. And those are some of the ideas people throw around. So we're at White Ranch. We're gonna try to recall her AF-126. Um, her battery's about dead. So we just need to catch her, put a new collar on, take some samples. In order to get GPS collars and mark these animals and be able to follow them around, we've gotta be able to catch them, tranquilize them, and actually put a collar on them. The dogs have been specifically trained to follow lion scent and lion scent only. You can hear the dogs. If you're quiet, you can hear the dogs. You can hear them down in the canyon. That means they are on the trail of the lion and they've got good scent in their nose. I have a handheld GPS that stays with me and I have a collar GPS that stays on the dog. So I can actually see my position and then I can get a compass bearing as well as a yardage distance to the dog. Uh, not yet, but they're on it. Lions are real solitary animals and the dogs come running up on them barking. They don't know what to do, so they just climb up a tree, get away from the noise. Wrong cat. That's a kitten. I knew there were two sets of tracks up there. See if we can find tracks of her over here, and we'll get the dogs. If you want to get your dogs, we'll look for tracks. She was with a kitten. We saw tracks of both up above. Um, so when they split off, the dog stayed with the kitten. So now we've got to find her track again, get the dogs back on that and get her treed. We'll leave this kitten alone. We're not gonna do anything with the kitten right now. It's just not part of our study. We've put GPS collars on all of the lions that we've captured. They get seven to eight locations a day. Talking about the Boulder area where you've got open space right up to the city boundaries. You'll see lions making daytime points out on open space. And then you'll see two or three points at night where they've moved off that, come into town, maybe made a kill, killed a raccoon or something, or deer. They feed on it and then they slip back out to the open space properties. So you go into these urban areas and you definitely see lions making these big movements. We're not seeing these movements out in remote areas away from people, which means they are still trying to separate themselves from the humans. Lions do seem to be afraid of people still. That's a decent track. Yeah, we looped back, started the tracks again and ended up back in the same spot. And there's just, you know, with that many cats running around, it's hard for the dogs to sort it out. You get dogs out on, on a lion track and you never know where you're gonna end up. Did you guys find a cat up there in the tree? I don't know yet. Based on the behavior that I've seen from these lions, I think there's the potential that lions and humans can coexist on the landscape. But in order for lions and humans to coexist, I think there's going to have to be a huge effort on the human population to learn to coexist with them. 
if people aren't responsible with their pets and, or their hobby livestock, lions are going to lose every time. The lion's going to end up dying because of that. See a cat? You need to run. Okay, I will be running up the hill. You guys want to catch him? Yes, we are. In your name? Oh. Uh -oh. Get above her, maybe she'll go down. Run her downhill. Downhill. Cat just jumped out of the tree. Copy. Every time you think it's easy, you're in for a long day. <laughs> <laughs>